Idaho's News Channel 7, this is the News at 10. I'm not sure that a lot of people really reflect very deeply on the cost of, of freedom, but it is, it comes at a high cost. Tonight, we're honoring the brave men and women who paid the price for our freedom here in the United States of America. Thousands of Idahoans, they gathered throughout the Treasure Valley for Memorial Day, and Abby Davis was there as the community remembered, and Abby, a day of remembrance and gratitude really across our area. Joe, some people went to official ceremonies, others visited cemeteries and tributes by themselves. A unified sound across the Treasure Valley. On this day, many Americans, including myself, are trying to commemorate or remember something we've personally never known. What it's like to make the ultimate sacrifice. Idahoans far and wide Monday honored veterans who died defending our freedom and way of life. Let us bow our heads in prayer. In Meridian, at the Rock of Honor Memorial. It's good that we all honor the people who sacrifice their lives. Everything we do, we owe it to these veterans. We should be grateful every day. In Boise, at Morris Hill and Military Reserve Cemeteries. <laughs> as well as the Idaho State Veterans Cemetery. So many uh, Americans have given their lives across all branches of service for the freedoms and the pleasures that we enjoy in our nation today. And so to give that, give that honor back to those who have lost their lives and who are buried here is an amazing thing. And I'm deeply honored to be here. In Nampa, community members lined Veterans Loop in Kohler Lawn Cemetery. And in Eagle. This is our 18th consecutive year. Hundreds of flags flapped in the wind, a tribute to those who serve and served. For a lot of people, it gives that, that peace of mind that their loved one didn't serve in vain. It, they, they had a purpose, and we remember that, and we appreciate that, and we recognize it. You hear stories, you know, that uh, we're, we're getting away from patriotism and all. It's nice to see it's still active, it's still alive. Yeah. It was good to see all these people. It's just wonderful. Of course, it's, of course, it's important to honor veterans throughout the year, not just today. One veteran we talked to says he always appreciates it when people thank him and other veterans for his service because he says it really just means a lot, Joe. Well, Abby, on a day where people really got to enjoy the weekend and be with their family, uh, it really you know, brings home the, the meaning of the freedoms we have and the perspective of the ultimate sacrifice. Abby, appreciate that so much.